All right, guys, so we're going to bring you a quick review today. Um, this is a 3D target stand from HME Outdoors. It says that it adjusts from 19 inches to 29 inches. Um, this metal is powder coated, so I believe it'll last for a while. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to tether this open, put it together, and then uh, we'll use this thing on our target. So stick with us while we uh, put this together. All right, guys, so this doesn't come with any kind of direction uh, how to put it together, but it's simple enough. If you look at it, um, you can line this up. You got two square holes and a round hole here. You've got three holes on this end. So basically gonna put it over this. We'll kind of do this quick for you. Drop our bolt in there. And we'll tighten it up. Grab your second one. Put it through the second hole. And we'll tighten it up. Now, it's going to take a little bit of actually tightening up with a wrench. So we'll get it as tight as we can. This way it'll keep it stable. our second piece and I apologize for any of the vehicle traffic but most of you are going to shoot at your house anyway um, not everybody lives out in the woods like I would like to but you got to do what you got to do but I do apologize for any dogs barking or vehicles driving by now we got our second leg in set it on its side and we'll go ahead and we'll tighten these up. Make sure it's all tight all the way around. All right, now you can see basically that's your base. We'll set this down. If you can see, we've got a little slot right here for this little adjustment lever. We'll start screwing it in. If you look on the underside, you got a push pin right here. You push this in can do it right and it adjusts it'll go all the way out as far as you want if you got a really big target or you slide it to your desired height and go from there simple as that now how do you put this on the target best I can figure this piece we got two of these are gonna fit right down in here pointing up Normally when you have a 3D target, they give you like a piece of rebar or, or steel and you hit that in the ground. Well, this is going to be holding up your 3D target. So, we'll go ahead and try to hold it. I'm just going to tell you, it's greased up, so I just got grease all over my hands. So I don't know if I can actually hold this to keep it up. It's pretty tight for the most part. We'll go ahead and put the other one on. Simply drop it down in. Lift it up. Put your bolt on there. And there you have it. So here is your 3D target stand all put together from HME Products. Uh, seems like it'll do the job. Um, we're gonna get us a 3D target. We'll put on here and we'll show you um, 
the adjustability and how well it stands up. My yard is actually not flat. It's on an angle and a hill, so we'll see how well this can keep its balance um, and do its job in case, you know, if we shoot and this is kind of downhill, is it going to knock our target over or is it going to stay balanced? So we'll see how that works. Um, so stay with us. We'll get our target out and we'll do a little shoot. Thanks, guys. All right, so we just got done shooting. Our target's about 17 yards. As you can see, my buddy's going to go and uh, pull our arrows. And because we got this new HME products target stand, he's able to just pick up the stand like you see and move it. So no stakes to mess with. Uh, pretty simple. So we'll see if we can shoot a little more. All right, guys, so we're going to show you how adjustable this 3D target stand is. You no longer have to use stakes in order to set your targets anywhere in your yard or anywhere you shoot. So, we're just going to toss them away. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to take our target stand, we're going to turn it sideways. I've got my turkey target, 3D target, simply place it in the hole, voila, there you go. Now, say I've got it at 15 yards, all i got to do is pick it up. And we'll move it back, say we're at now, you know, 25 yards, whatever. That's all you gotta do. Simple. Alright, so now we're gonna show you how adjustable it is. We're gonna take off our turkey target. We're gonna set it sideways. We're gonna grab our 3D target. Alright, so as you can see, we've got our 3D target, and the way the legs are, it's not going to match up. Well, put the back leg in, slide the front leg over till it meets. Just like that. That's how adjustable it is. So you slide it in and out, set it to what you got, turn your knob right here, tighten it up, and it's not going to open. It's going to be set to your decoy now. So you can leave it there the entire year, um, but if a friend of yours comes over, has a different kind of target, it might be a little bit wider or shorter, so you can adjust it. So pretty simple. Now, like I said, say we got this at uh, 15 yards, we want to move it to 25. All we got to do is pick up our target, and we can move it basically anywhere we want. So. We're going to throw a few arrows at this target and show you how the, the base holds up to uh, being here on a, a small, slight hill. Um, hopefully it's pretty stable enough that it's not going to fall over, so let's check out some shots. I'll go grab the bow and uh, shoot this target a few times. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take a few shots at the target and we're going to see how stable the stand is. Um, I'm on a slight angle, so we'll see how it works out. So far it's working pretty good. Alright guys, so as you just saw, I put some arrows into the target. The target itself shakes, but the stand, it's not going anywhere. This de The decoy, the target, is not going to flip over, fall over when you shoot it. So it's worked very reliable just for this review. Um, like I said, it's adjustable from 19 to 29 inches, so that gives you a variety of different targets that you can fit on this uh, stand. You got to see the turkey target decoy that I put on here. Um, that can be used as well. So there's so many different 3D targets out there anymore. You can use it for anything. So that adjustability definitely helps. Um, hopefully I've got about 15, 16 more days until the opening day here in Tennessee. So with all the practice I'm going to do in the next coming weeks, um, I'll put this to good use and hopefully it will help me become a better shot for archery season. I'm headed to Kansas in November, so hopefully I can take a big buck there as well. So check out HME Products. Um, check them out on Facebook as well, and we'll leave you the address to their website at the end of this review. So thanks guys for checking this out, and this is the HME Products 3D Target Stand.